let's learn about sterling numbers of the second kind this is closely related to the two of the most interesting problems in elementary combinatorics the partition problem and the onto function problem you can check that many of the olympiads isi cmi entrances they have questions concerning these two topics they are very closely related as we will see the sterling numbers of the second kind are taught in the chinta math olympiad program and the ISI CMI entrance program so you can check the link in the description for that now let's explain what it is okay suppose you have a number 10 I will use this notation of square bracket 10 to imply the set of numbers from 1 to 10. Now a partition of these 10 numbers is exactly what its English meaning is. You split it into several pieces. how many pieces well you can split it into at most 10 pieces because each of the pieces must contain something so this is the one extreme case where you split 10 numbers into 10 partitions the other extreme is this there is only one partition and basically there are all the 10 numbers are in the same partition so these are the two extremes Let's look at a case which is somewhere in the middle. Let's suppose we have three pieces. So maybe in the first part you have one, two, three. In the second part you have four, seven, and in the third part you have five, six, eight, nine, ten. This is one way to split 10 numbers into 3 parts. 10 numbers into 3 parts. In some books they use this notation. They use a long double double bracket with the number at the top telling you how many numbers you were partitioning and the number at the bottom telling you how many parts are there so if i write 5 2 that basically means i have five numbers 1 2 3 4 5 5 5 and i want to partition them into two parts so maybe one way to do it is 1 3 2 4 5 Another way to do it 
is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then there are other ways of doing this. Sometimes we are interested to find out the total number of ways we can do this. That's the Starling number of the second kind. How many ways, how many ways can you partition n distinct objects into r parts? R parts and um, that is denoted by NR and we say that this is the sterling number of the second book second kind okay now there is a way to compute sterling numbers and then there is another way to relate them with odd two functions In the next video, we will do the computation and the one that follows it, we will talk about the onto functions. Till then, you can look in the link in the description for some more resources on combinatorics, some practice problems and reading materials. Keep on doing great mathematics. I will see you in the next video.